Oh, there we go. Come on. Fish on his therapy. It's time to go get that therapy, boy. All right, let's go, guys. 5.30 in the morning. About to head out to catch some eels, boy. You know, get my stuff ready, man. You know, we're using a uh, medium heavy rod. My ugly stick, Tiger. Yeah, what I like. I mean, I got a 65 pound braid on here, P line. Go out for some eels, some rubber licks, lips, black perch, any rockfish that bite. I'm excited. Let's do it. I'm going to see you guys out there. And we'll see if we can have a good day. It may be a little bit windy. We should be able to catch the minus tide. The minus tide is about minus 0.6. So that's still good. And high tide will be around 1240. So we'll see if we can get the action, man. Get on some fish. I'm going to try a combination of some swim baits. Uh, high low rig shrimp on it um i just throw a few different uh type of baits out there and play around man but we got to scale down a huge rock oh, it's gonna be exciting man to exhilarate see you out there fishing is therapy i'm getting my therapy which one the brown one like the brown that comes so guys right here at this part man where oh, you see yeah. this arrow we're getting ready to descend down this steep steep slope man it has poison right oak here it's it. steep and actually the video doesn't do it justice man but i'm gonna try to show you guys a few of the clips of us heading down Whew, man this took all my energy man so at this point guys we just hopped over the gate and we're starting to descend here. It's slippery. It's really dense. Poison ivy, man. My nose is going crazy because the wind is blowing right at us. But we're heading to that little island out there. And we're, we're going to see if we can throw some swim baits, try to catch some rockfish, some link hot. Uh, stay tuned to see how it goes. But uh, we got quite a ways to go. The trip is just beginning, guys. finally gotten to our true descent point where there's a rope and you guys should already know when there's a rope that means there's some steep downhill action and keep in mind this is going to be the same area that once we have a bunch of fish hopefully in our bags and with all our gear at the end of the day after being exhausted we're going to have to ascend right back up this area so I'm glad that they have a rope because definitely it gets a little bit treacherous. You have to watch your footing. But there's a lot of little footholds here. If you take your time, you definitely should be all right, guys. So, But I recommend never going and doing this alone and always having someone that understands the terrain as my buddy Sotero does.
Ya. Last little challenge of part. Uh, fucking made it. Uh. All right, guys. Thank you for coming along for the journey. Finally made it down. There we are. Area. We're Here. gonna walk over to it now. That was a long trek down. Thanks for staying tuned. I know it's a lot of content, but hopefully it gives you guys a better view and understanding of what it takes to get down on the Muir Beach Overlook. All right, guys. We just arrived. Now. Time to try to catch some fish. I have to get geared up. Hopefully, it's a real good day. Everything should be good today. We're gonna toss some swim baits and some Kitex. Try to catch some eel and some rubber lift. And whatever else, bike, kept greenlands and things like that. So you guys stay tuned. I'll put you either on the point of view head mount or the chest mount. So stick with me for more action. Had a good bite. All right, good bite heading this way, y'all. Let's see, Let's see if he returns. I got a bite. <laughs> Sink all the way to the bottom. Ah, oh. yeah. Bit my tail off. Yeah. 
Y'all want? Oh, okay. ah. Oh. And I keep getting bit right there, man. Yeah. Right there. What? <laughs> Biting the tail. Right here, right there. Like right there. Like coming straight in. Keep biting. Huh? One? one fell off. I didn't keep him. I didn't get him. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Come on. Linka. There we are. This the guy that been. This the guy that been biting right here. Yeah, they there. Woo! Look at that one. I'm gonna swim bait. Okay, they got bites. There you go. There you go. There you go, one. Oh, I got a perch here. Rockfish. Hurry up. Uh, I almost lost him. Look at that. Look how, look at where I caught him at, y'all. Gosh, I almost lost him. Got one. There we go.
perch. No, rockfish. Yep, crab greenling. Blue meat. All right, y'all, this is the end of the day ransom. It was a rough day today, man. The winds were crazy. Um, you know, but we still made it work. Uh, Sotero, he got a link out over there. You'll see that in the pictures and stuff, but I got uh, two rockfish. One nice size, one average. Nice size rockfish. Another. And uh, two black perch. So uh, it's over for us today. I've had my therapy. Had my therapy, man. So let me know what you guys think. Drop down in the comments. Um, we're over here near Muir Beach. That was awesome. Great scenery, man. But uh, time to check out, get home, and cook the fish. Hopefully better luck next time. But hey, one link hot, two rockfish, and two perch. Can't beat it. At least we didn't get skunk, right? Everyone, every fisherman knows the name of the game. See y'all. Peace out. Fishing is therapy. Yeah, all right, this is our scale. We gotta go all the way up there. See where the sky meets the mountain? That's where we're going. Starting, I just started from down there. So anybody who think they wanna come and do this, you uh, gotta be down for this though. So let's do it. Put you back on my head and rock out. Oh, it's good. <sighs> Terror up there looking like a mountain goat. Got a whole mountain to scale, y'all. This is why a lot of people don't come to this place. But you know, when they got a rope, that means it ain't no joke. Just so y'all can see, ain't no damn joke. Keep going though. Tired, but gotta keep going. <coughs> no joke, huh? No joke. Calves on fire. Quads on fire. You give me a seat. Hey, no joke.
kind of break. Over the 